words manifest like the steam on my breath, condensation on my mind. Hello guys, it's Unders and we are in Logic and we're looking at Isotope Neutron 3 and this is the dive into the Sculptor module which is a new module added to the Neutron range. What does it do? Now if we rewind a couple of years, I did a video on something called Neutrino which was a little add-on which helped you essentially sculpt specific sounds in a mix. If you set it to instruments, it highlighted key instrument areas and vocals and bass. This is that thing essentially, but taken to the extreme. If we were to open up Neutron 2, it used to exist down here. And this is just a vastly improved version of it. It's a lot more tweakable than it used to be. And it's got extra, let's say presets or profiles or sculptors of what it could be. So let's see what it does after a real brief bit of explanation. So the idea being, it is actually a multiband compressor split up into 32 different bands. I believe 32 is correct. If it's 64, I apologize, but I'm pretty sure it's 32. Um, and then it's got a profile set to a particular sound type to make sure, to make sure that key elements of that particular type of sound are lifted out and other areas are compressed and suppressed and it balances everything together. It's like making your sound into a jigsaw puzzle based on roughly where it should fit and then kind of placing it and then you can tweak from there. So I've got this on the vocal bus of this track, which hopefully I've looped something sensible. We'll see. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Good enough. So when you open up Sculptor, this is what you get. Uh, you get sort of the, the instrument presets, you know, bass, guitar, keys, orchestral, percussion, and voice. Or we've got add fullness, add polish, add punch, instrument bus. Technically, this is an instrument bus, but I'm not going to be picky. We're going to pretend it's a voice because it's a voice. So if we choose voice, oh, look at that. It's now got dialogues or vocals. So if I'm doing a voiceover, boom, I can stick it on dialogue and it's going to help sculpt this voiceover. Uh, I don't use that. I use RX, but maybe we'll test it out in a future video. We're going to choose voice and go vocals. Boom. So it's now done its thing. So if I play it back. That road, they ain't stacking no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real, they ain't really out in the street. So you can see all this fanciness going on in the middle. There's loads of low end, and what it's doing is taking away loads of that low end. It knows that a vocal probably shouldn't have like a 100 hertz fundamentals and things like that going on. It's just not a, a normal vocal unless you're a huge bassy individual. So look, it's removing all of that. And then in the high end, it's going, there's usually a good bit of space here and we've got it uh, working with this vocal. So we're going to lift that up there. Check it out. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. Cool, so those like uh, like three, four bars, whatever I just played, I'm just going to loop that right there. I'm going to A, B it for you. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. Right, so it's really, really subtle what it's doing, but it just adds a little bit of little bit of shine, right? Just a little, little bit of flavor in there. And it's kind of nice, but that's what you want. You don't want this to be ridiculously making the vocal shine and gleam beyond belief because you're going to look to apply this to everything and have that subtle balance occur everywhere so together everything shines and works in harmony that's the real idea of it now the controls themselves there's a few things to look at uh, we've got this guy here so this is just the intensity of the processing applied so let's 100 percent it because you know we have to that road they ain't stack no dough they ain't never made no pee Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. Right, so you can hear what that's doing. It's taking out so much in the body now, it's starting to sound tinny. Um, a bit like um, iPhone recording kind of vibe. It's getting rid of that low end and anywhere there could be rumble. Let's that road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. And if we bring it right down, it's barely gonna touch it. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. So we can find a good blend of what we like. So we'll stick with 50 because it's nice and in the middle and no one can complain about 50, right? Then we've got tone. So 
if you've used any kind of distortion, you've always got that tone area, right? Where you're going to be pushing it and creating the distortion. Similar principle, except this is designed to always be transparent and clear and not add distortion. It kind of gives you that middle point that it's going to work from. Think of it like that. So you go and distort, you want this area to distort and go and be proper aggressive. This is the area you want to stand out and be clear and harmonic and lovely. Yeah. It's the opposite to distortion, but it's a similar principle, if you get me. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. Cool. Really accentuating really the high end. That road, Let's bring it low. No they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't bring real. Bring it low as a body out, right? They ain't really out in the street. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't get how that works. Speed, I don't think I need to demo. It's the ballistics. It's how fast it's going to work. Um, think of it like compressors and your whole attack and release time. Go on, we'll do it. Let's go 100% and then 100% on tone and then 100%. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. Now, zero was too slow, 100 was too fast. So again, I'm going to leave it at 50. It's kind of working there. It's almost like they planned and worked this out, right? There's a couple of other things that are in here, and it's not immediately obvious, so just make sure I highlight them. There's a couple of handles, so you can narrow down the area this guy is going to work in. They're hidden left and right here, look, just as these weird little outlines. And we can drag them in, and anywhere it does the light gray, it's no longer going to be really doing this effect because you've got those 32 band splits it can literally cut them off super quick because uh, it must have like a 96 kilohertz roll off that road they ain't stack no dough they ain't never made no pee talk crud like they're bad they ain't real yeah so if we really liked what it was doing around the one three k region we can literally do that pump it up that road they ain't stack no dough they ain't never made no pee talk crud like they're bad they ain't real they ain't really out in the street. And that's actually pretty nice. I think if we slow that down a little bit and maybe bring that to like 70, that'll that'll actually be an improvement. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. Talk crud like they're bad, they ain't real. They ain't really out in the street. That road, they ain't stack no dough, they ain't never made no pee. That is actually a really nice little clarity improvement. That, guys, is the sculptor, what it does, and its purpose. Uh, and that little thing there has just impressed me. So I'm probably going to keep diving into this, and maybe you'll find the whole thing's been done by the next video. Who knows? I hope the video was helpful for you guys. I hope you understand the sculptor a little bit better, and I look forward to seeing you guys on the next video. Thank you very much.